Dum, 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 dum. Then uh, I think uh, we're back online here. So uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. And um, all right, is the audio fine now? hope everything is swell at least so um let's uh take a look at the account ah oh, jesus hang on it's better now and it's sweet and nice and uh and beautiful all right thanks Biaga. You're the man. Um, yeah, I think it's about time I click the rate list. I think it's approximately like uh, 120 or something like that. TTs we send out every time we do the farm list. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an update of where what happened yesterday and uh, or do th through the night and what we're doing today. And uh, we're trying to get some units out. We're just running that stable on level five. Uh, or 15 and uh, pumping a little bit just trying to keep an hour queue uh, oh, and then we're just hero rating he also just got a level up so that's nice we're up to 84 uh, points so big damage so we clear a lot so it's very nice hero just running around I think we spent like a hundred ointments or so uh, again just for hitting stuff that's close by and bigger um, but again, you can just stick to the clay stuff, and uh, I've also been hitting these guys a little bit. Let's see, I think... No... I need to find a target. I also got annoyed and, uh, and bought a small map, just so he's a little faster. Um, so he should be home in seven minutes. Uh, but I should hit something big and juicy. This is nice. Like, this doesn't really cost any health, right? Um, but I think I was thinking about that one. Yeah, isn't bad at all. Yeah, approximately the same. Uh, this was also one of the bigger ones. Well, we don't like the bears, but it's still a great raid. And it'll cost us 40 ointments. I might just do those two big big ones, and then we can do some some other small stuff. Um, but uh, right now we're also doing, <coughs> like production-wise since yesterday, what we did was, um, I think we got all to eight. Um, and then we raided a lot and, <laughs> and Nick focused a lot on the capital, uh, getting one to 10 um, and then uh, getting a bakery to three. And and then uh, I've just been making tens. So, ooh, close. Um, so getting those done, we get a big reward when that's done. Right now I'm also working on nines here. Um, we're also automatically going to get some population rewards and uh, culture points and stuff like that. Um, so just growing like this really helps with the EXP reset, right? Um, and then, um, yeah, production is really kicking in. Um, yeah, a small 30k here as well. Um, plan is pretty much this evening. We're going to get all to 10 in both of them. Uh, and then uh, spawn can focus on uh, getting stable to 20 and just spamming TTs. Like when I got up this morning, we pretty much doubled our TT numbers due to uh, to the stable upgrade. So that was pretty nice. Currently, I just have the production buildings on three until we kind of maybe I'll when we finish all to nine, I'll push these to five. 
<clears throat> but uh, it's not uh, set in stone. Uh, I might just do those to 10. Um, but hey, Paige, welcome to the stream. Hey, Tweet, you're not dead yet. Got anyone near you that you want to take out? I'm quitting. I got 3,000 slaves I need to get rid of. <laughs> Well, uh, I know this dude with like uh, 70 legionnaires. You could kill him and trade all your units for it. Uh, slaves are quite terrible. Uh, as is um, hero rank. Um, again, we're just grinding. So now we're at 8. Only 4,000 behind. Three and a half. So, um, yeah, we we're just grinding with the hero, right? And then micro raiding with the rest. We also made a little list for the capital, but we're not really building any TTs there. We're just uh, raiding a little bit and then uh, just focusing on production, production, production. So, we've got to check this out, guys. Um, like resource rank 19 now, even with all the chips out there. Uh, overall, we're five with the rating. Uh, defense or offensively we've risen to 21 due to the stable upgrades and uh, defensive we're actually down to 5 and that's I mean Nick talked about it it's mainly because of Steppe and then they're not only making Steppe now they're also making um, Mercs or whatnot. so and again we haven't kept up our Phalanx production so we're falling a little bit behind there but that's no problem and uh, then we have some CP. Um, don't do like us. We forgot to put on a party yesterday, just one, so we could actually do the daily quest. Uh, oh, it already reset. Um, but yesterday it was um, three parties needed. You know, get everything to 100 and you get 400 CP reward. So you see a lot of people on the server that uh, already settled. But uh, I don't know. We're just chilling. People got third. We're like, we're not that far behind. We're again getting all these to 10, which the other guys won't have. So we're just laying a foundation uh, for our production. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, well, respect to the slaves, you know. Uh, good job. Like, you should do it as Egypt. But, um, but unfortunately, they're just terrible on the offense. Uh, let's see. Hero home soon, right? Yeah, one minute. Um, but yeah, right now, like yesterday, is a little bit more messy. It's like artifact release. You know, you do a lot of stuff at the same time and you try and cover some ground with all the rating. Um, but now we're kind of in chill mode. Uh, I haven't done anything on our farm lists all morning, like we're pretty much covered in regards to the amount that we have. So we're just running those lists uh, slow and steady. Um, and so not really stuff going on there. Um, we're, we are pretty much simming, yeah. Uh, I might just go and check for micro farms and whatnot and try and do some tests. Uh, I think I did some BP tests here. Let's see. I don't want to add these right now. This is not interesting. These ones we could take a look at. Uh, just sneak them in there. I'm not sure. Are these? Yeah, they're in BP. Um, let's move them there. Delete this list. Remove all the clutter. <sighs> I'm not sure about these. Like the thing we did last night, just around midnight, uh, we built a TS. Rushed rally point to 15, got a TS level 4, and then uh, it really helps because you can't like it's not like Oasis where there's a lot close by. Micro farms are spread a lot more widely, so you really need to get that TS up to be able to exploit your speed above 20 fields. Um, oh, that was a late notification from Stream Elements, <laughs> but okay. 
Um, nope, heroes back. Mm. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to hit that right. And then the other big gray one. But we'll just start with this one. A rotate time of like, before he's back again, like 25 minutes. Um. <coughs> Otherwise, I hope you're doing good on the server, guys. People just chilling. <laughs> uh, these guys are going ham, apparently. They already hit this guy next to us with catapults, and uh, and they wanted to, I think, hit this guy. But I haven't really been tracking his pop. But uh, yeah, they're beating around the the neighborhood. Um, it looks interesting. Hey, Haro. Why do we hold our hero adventures? Well, we're not holding them. Uh, we're like, <laughs> we just don't have the time to do them. That's pretty much it. Like for us, we're not really interested in finding anything we can sell to people or anything. And the value that generates from hero hitting an oasis just gives resources. So anything else, ointments, cages, whatever you could find on a, an adventure, even resources, that would be less value than uh, clearing uh, animals and getting resources that we can invest into stuff. So the fact that we have seven, t seven adventures banked up now is simply because, yeah, ever since we got released from BP, we haven't had time to do anything else. Uh, and again, we're just grinding the hero, so maybe when he reaches level 100 we'll ch take a chill break convert all to resources and then do all the adventures um, they're mainly surrounded uh, at cab area um, so but um, oh yeah I can check here yeah cab area so we'll do them at some point but there's just no value to doing it right now Boom, boom. Uh, Six thousand. We got a bunch of stuff here. Uh, yeah, whatever. It's a little better doing the crops first, but. Again, right now, I just uh, even things out here. Like, we just have to mill here three, 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 three. Um, yeah, mill to five is a little expensive, but again, we can get the greenery to three. Also boosts a lot, but yeah, it's mainly important here on the cropper to, uh, to get that bakery three. Uh, yeah, exactly, Christian. And welcome back. Nice to have you guys around. Nick was like, uh, <laughs> Nick was on fire yesterday and was like, "Yeah, I'm gonna be night duel. I'm gonna take the account. I'm gonna do everything." And you know, I, and then uh, I came on this morning and uh, and then he was like, "Hey, can you take the account for like half an hour? I'll be right back." And I'm pretty much sure he's sleeping right now and just left me stranded with the account and everything. So the way it should be, right? But, uh, <laughs> but just funny, he, uh, he disappeared. Uh, let me see. Yeah, all good. And thanks for following Jerry. Very nice. Um, let's see, 
yeah, we could do one more level 10. Boom. I'm just being very basic here, costing 5 gold every time to, 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 to just making one. Like, I just want this to 10 at as fast as possible. Um, so that will be done tonight, and as soon as we do that, we are actually going to continue our 11s. Um, because then we're going to rush this one to 10 as well. Uh, get that stable to 20, and then gonna keep that production running uh, with the TTs, but use everything to just boost into the capital. So we're gonna do all to 11, uh, and then Hero Mansion 15. So a big pile of resources gonna be pushed into that during the night. Uh, hey, United. Long time no see, but again, long time no stream. So, um, nice to have you back. Um, and yeah, sorry if uh, I forced you to watch Horizon Zero Dawn instead, but um, I'm going to do a mix of it. Um, a bit of gold united and uh, a lot of time and, uh, and a little bit of skill. Um, Jerry, uh, this might be impossible to answer, but how much gold on average do you need for X1 server handling second village a cropper and just have fun for at least a few months? I don't know. I can't really answer due to the fact I don't know uh, gold costs on X1. Like, I play X3, X5, and X10. Um, but you can definitely... Do it cheap, I would say. But again, you th I think you organically auto-complete more things on an X1. It's hard to sim stuff, right? So, and I don't know what an average account looks like, but... Um, no, you have your NPC rates, that's definitely lower on an X1, right? And, yeah. 600 gold? Okay. Thanks, Fankovic. But again, yeah, he's also asking for the, the median, right? So... But cool. Good thing you guys can help each other out. Um, you on the way. <coughs> So actually, yeah, we're kind of stagnant in regards to action. <laughs> like, <laughs> like again, it's just micro list. We're not really doing anything. Like, just checking, are we getting any yellow swords? I think if you guys remember this one from yesterday, like, she's just been popping. There's no units in the town. She's just building up crannies, making extra storage capacity and working on some fields. And then she's blocking us from raiding. So, of course, I just remove it. And that's the only farm today I've done anything to. Like, um, we're we're doing fine, chill. Uh, got a lot of micro stuff, and uh, rating is decent. Uh, we're still rank six. Uh, this guy kind of overtook us. He's just grinding up. Um, but other than that, we're these guys can't really f keep up uh, down here. Um, and we're just, yeah, about to overtake this guy. So, we'll be five in a little bit. So, just slow and steady. Um, yeah. Nice and chill. Yeah, well, we still have our cranny in spawn. <laughs> Level 10. It's fine to have. It's good CP generation right now, and uh, and if we get attacked, we can easily spend down, and they don't get any loots. Um, but it's gonna be amazing getting uh, this done with production. We will also need that extra fifty percent oasis at some point. But uh, but prioritizing boosting to the capital and getting getting that pushed up is a lot more crucial. Um, T 
TTQs are fine, right? Yeah. Like, the income is pretty sweet right now, and then with some big hero hits, so it'll be easy to get these nines done. Um, just missing, like, seven. So. We'll get that done together. At least. Um, do, 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 do. I could go and chill and find some micro farms and bash around. Should I finish ten in starter or finish nine in village one? You mean village two? Like, because village one is your starter originally. Maybe it's called O one. Yeah, okay. Um, I'm just mm, because I'm not sure what the best course of action is for you. I wouldn't mind keeping them independent. Like you don't don't push any of them, but maybe take your resources if you're still raiding with the hero and dedicate that to your cropper. To be honest, you kind of want to focus on your cropper. Um but, but, and then here comes the but, right? Because you kind of want to get these to 10 um, on all of them, just so you can get the bonus buildings. It kind of means a lot. So if you're very close to that and you have everything in eight, I would rush one of them to 10 in your spawn and then get these to three and then say, okay, now it's really independent. And then you can just focus all your hero uh, ra hero rating into the capital and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, I can talk about the farm list tweet. Like, like we just have this one as the test, right? And we have it here on with a dot simply because it's the one that shows up on the map. Um, I like keeping all that stuff at the top, um, and <laughs> and then I at least for what is active, I always write active here. But that's just doesn't really matter. It just reminds us to deactivate all other stuff, right? But right now it's a mess. Like it's random micros farms that has been added that might be in BP or not and it's just a clutter of that I've just moved a few of them into uh, active list but I have a bunch more of them but they're further away so it's not really something we're mixing into the active lists but every time we add something we remember to deactivate it so we can still use the start all button all the time right that's kind of the the main thing, so it doesn't matter where everything is located right now. But I could definitely clear away a few of these lists uh, just to have less clutter, but it doesn't really matter when everything is running fine. Um, we have this kata list, we're going to be using that for later on, and then a yellow list, kind of, if we bump into something. Personally, I like moving them away from lists, so I can always see we sent 100 out of 100 farms, and so try and keep things organized. The catalyst is again just gonna be something that should be on the big list but if we want to start taking down residences and walls so we can either easily more easily raid it with like swordsmen or something like then um, then we'll use that but so right now it's just clutter. Um, and again, we have one test list here that Nick just decides to keep rating on. And again, here you can see where you <laughs> have them active in between. I think some of these are also in BP, of course. And like, it's it's a uh, unorganized mayhem right now. So I would prefer not showing it, but you know, it's it works, and um, we're still top rating. So you know, just clicking that. And then um, we'll see when we really need to start fixing it. I could imagine we would have to f at least update it and fix it some more and release some of these uh, inactive ones that we move into the active lists because we are building like 20 TTs an hour currently. So, so uh, again, 
we'll keep updating it. Uh, oh, sorry, uh, zero to twenty. Like it's just the travel, di or it's just the diff distance. So, so let let's say I want to do a big hit, and I'm recollecting four hundred of the TGs to do that then I just know that the only thing I can really click and should be clicking is the 0 to 20 because of the rotating time on the rates. So it doesn't make sense starting to click all the other ones, so you just make sure you're always sending at a max distance. So so yeah, we go from 0 to 20, 20 to 35, and 35 to 50. But again, there is some clutter in between that shouldn't be there. Uh, I think it goes up to your 40. I accidentally moved in one in earlier. But uh, that's just the indication. Uh, and the phalanx, yeah, they're just chilling. Like, to be honest, we could easily make some farm lists and uh, sit and raid with them. We kind of should. But at the same time, I like having the defense home. I'm not a guy, or we are not guys that likes raiding with defense. Like, suddenly you'll need it, and then you don't have it. So, you know, it's... Um, Call it laziness, call it precaution, um, but it would increase our rating a bit if we did, but uh, it's not that much. So uh, we're satisfied with what we're getting. So yeah, I hope that explains that. Um, um, mm, is there more to the farm lists? Not really. Like, I could just show how it should be looking, to be honest. Uh, we need one BP list. Um. <laughs> These guys are probably still in beginner's protection, or they're banned. Like all these IQs are are probably banned. Yeah. Delete uh, beginner. Beginner. Mm-hmm. <coughs> So I would probably take, yeah, these three. Move them into that BP list. We're gonna. Let's see what's this. Hmm. Should be able to rate that though. I'm not sure why it's inactive. Uh, but I'll move them to the BP test. <coughs> and we can just run a test on it. Uh, activate all. Boom. So just those two for now. Uh, deactivate all. Um. These will just let stay here, I guess. Nah. It's a little excessive that the uh, these are here in the active list, but we're not going to be sending max anyways. Um, okay, you should be on the BP list. Okay. organize the mayhem like this is a big list uh, it should include bigger rates later on like 50 100 TTs but right now we could mix them into the other lists uh, because they're not that huge um, so but it doesn't matter again we just click the start all 
so no need to organize it that much more. Uh, and this one's just inactive. I'll, I press it every now and then. It also contains BP people, uh, just with higher population. Um, but yeah. Uh, we got 80. I'll wait a few minutes, then we can send it. Hello, York. <laughs> Any luck with adventures? Oh, uh, no. <laughs> Again, we don't have time for them, so not not doing them right now. Oh, hey, hey, Nick, you're awake. <laughs> Are you going to win this server? You're asking? No, no. I'm. Uh, we're just chilling goofing around. I was gonna play solo and a hybrid and uh, now all of a sudden p random people here are signing up and uh, now we have a small alliance and um, I don't I don't know what's gonna happen man. We got no clue. Yeah I knew it. I knew it. Sleepyhead. But all good. You had a long night. <laughs> So, uh, and this is my cross to bear, just keeping things running. But uh, I managed to chill some still. So, yeah, nothing, nothing fancy, guys. Again, just working on that production, and uh, it's nice to see it's paying off. Like being 18 in production now, it's pretty good. Um, we could do some micro rating and adding in a, just a little bit. I think I'm gonna. I'm sitting here in a cross position with the legs, so I'm gonna, you know, give them some air and uh, and we can do some farming in uh, in a few minutes. So I'll be right back, guys. Thanks for tuning in.
Yo, yo, yo. Thanks for joining the Discord, uh, Admiral. Very nice. I lose my hero and delete account. Wait, what? <laughs> Things escalated while I was gone. Hey, Mamba. Um, TTs are fine. Almost 700 now. And the hero got a big hit, so just reinvesting that into spawn, right? Boom, boom, boom. Uh, could do two nine there, but let's do these first. A little cheaper. Ah, fifteen hundred. We'll get that in with the rating pretty quickly. Uh, six minutes on the timer right now. And this one soon too. Here's home in four minutes. And we can do a nice big raid down here, right? <sighs> we could do that one. Um, but we were also talking about this one, right? Can we do that with our current life pool? Yeah. Yeah, and we'll get a big load, 12,000. Oh, I think I'll do that. It's a decent travel time too. <laughs> oh yeah, of course, of course Nick went to bed. He killed his hero. <laughs> it's like, ah, and he couldn't use a bucket for four hours. Like, yeah, then it's time to go to bed and uh, just lay there and cry it out. But um, shit happens. At least he didn't kill my hero. Yeah, R rage napping. <laughs> uh, it happens to the best of us. 500 missing now, so a thousand in a few minutes. That's rating is decent. Uh, we're up to like eight minutes now soon, so we could set the rate list no problem, but I'll just delay a little bit. Um, boom, boom, boom. Why aren't you using any tools to add farms? Because I used the tool once before and then that got like, uh, it, it stopped working and then uh, there are some other tools but I never figured out how to use them and uh, I like looking at the map. I, I like inspecting things and check players out and be like, oh, what what's that guy doing there? Oh, he might be scary. And then you stalk him for a few days and be like, nah, he's not that bad. And, you know, you, you kind of get a sense of what's around you. And I like that part about it. And again, when we start raiding now, like the first day where we just added sporadically everywhere and we couldn't see where we were going and so forth, that was annoying. But now when we have the map uh, triggers here, we, we kind of know what we're rating and uh, easy to find hold and holes and find people we can look into and like what weird settlement. Uh, but again, yeah, so I, I, I like using the map. It's pretty chill. It's like it still gets you from A to B. But it would definitely be easier using a farm tool and Summer, the night duel, she likes using a tool. So what I don't find, she finds. And sometimes we find things neither of us would have found on our own, you know. So having different styles kind of clashes well sometimes. Um, so there's nothing wrong as long as you get new farms and uh, they're safe and uh, you don't get yellow swords or red swords. Then, uh, then you're pretty good and you're golden. <laughs> okay, damn. Um, <laughs> it's also hard finding B 
pick guys to farm if you're using an inactive finder because yeah they're they are active but sometimes they're very inactive you know an uh, inactive finder only shows up after three days of inactivity you know so so finding good stuff can also be a little tricky on uh, on micro farming and also i don't find it that useful in the early stages and again it's not hard to cover what you need in the early stages so <coughs> yeah, I think it's oh that IQ guy. Like Jesus. But again, some micro farms I've missed. Or just wasn't out of BP, so we had no interest in them. But yeah, again, so there's not that much to add right now, guys. Um, oh. It's because they're not extended, 23. I think what we found here is, is fairly close. Uh, oh, wait, it's close to our capital. Oh, I've been having all of them to the capital. Eh, a few to the spawn, and uh, <laughs> oh well. And ah, uh, now they're directly in on Nick's active list. Uh, ah, Nick. Okay. Uh, let's let's take everything that's active here. This is my bad. And then they are all active down here. We can deactivate this one. Do they get added? No. How far these are close to center, these needs to go out to the capital, I guess. And then we'll have them as a test and we can run a test on those and deactivate them and heroes home uh, we wanted to go here right that should be fine Yeah, <coughs> but yeah, I was talking about uh, inactive finder. So, all right, I think we can do another crop field there, and here we can do another crop field too, and then we can put on 
some TTs and uh, maybe I'll queue up to another hour and then we'll do uh, two extra fields again and then do a queue and then <coughs> four fields and then yeah just to keep everything running and yeah yeah we're, we're slowly climbing up uh, our production here it's very nice so that it just means we can raid less, so more slacking guys. Do you know anything about these Thai guys? Um, um, and yeah, Hero is still not in production, right? So if we convert, we're probably top 10 production or something. Uh, Thai guys, I don't know who these Thai guys are you're talking about, but I think, is it, mm, yeah, these Thai, I, no, no, wait, <laughs> I'm not looking at top 10 at all, um, I don't know who they're supposed to be. Okay, second alley. Okay, so these guys. But no, man, I have no idea. But uh, they all have second, so... Yeah. All of them getting some croppers and growing, so looks like a big alliance. But also full of weird stuff. Ah, uh, that looks nice. And they're playing minus minus. Hmm. But no, I have uh, I have no clue. But uh, people chilling out on the server, it's good. The more, the merrier. And yeah. Oh really? So he didn't find a duel, so now he's just selling. Oh, he cleared everything from his description. <laughs> I guess he's going AFK. Oh, if you are interested in this account, PM me. <laughs> uh, anybody want to buy my account? Hey, Bluffmore. Thanks for following uh, earlier. No, that was yesterday, I think. Um, but uh, nice to have you around. Well, welcome to the shit show. Um... Yeah, and again, scouts are just chilling right now. They're just defensively working for us. FC. But uh, nah, we can't. Uh, he's too far away, right? Yeah, he's in minus minus. But he has a nice cropper. I liked his setup, but apparently. Um, he only likes the early game. Boom, boom. So yeah, again, now we're just back to clicking the farm list, right guys? Every 10 minutes, and then again, just working on those uh, level 10s and 9s here. But, uh, so we'll start growing pretty hard soon, production-wise. That uh, sounds like a plan, Nick. I'm sure he's down for it. <laughs> but the uh, best thing we could do is actually fill this up with a lot more uh, micro-orientated uh, farms and then run a test on it and then filter it out into the lists and uh, just so we keep having enough uh, farms for our units it doesn't hurt being ahead of your scheduling um, just like when we started uh, out of BP you know, do some prep work and, uh, and you stress yourself out a little less mm. okay well, he just looks like a farm. So, but he is on the test list. 
No, no. <laughs> but I think I'll put five on it and then uh, just test it and then uh, deactivate. So we'll see how the test rate goes, otherwise we'll just scout it and uh, again then normally it goes on the catalyst and then you remove the residence and wall and then when it's done you can move it up into an active list. That's how I process it. Um, I guess you could also move it further up and stuff, but yeah. Like, put things like that and then have all the actives down here. And it's simpler for everybody to process. Scout it, find out what it has, test it. If it doesn't work, move it down to a, a catalyst. Um, yeah. Keep processing. Uh, Y'all putting a lines together plus plus or? No, 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 we're not putting an alliance together, man. We just chill it. People I invited are just people who started on the server and, uh, yeah, just for goofing around together. <coughs> Apparently. <laughs> so, yeah. Can you show General Tap and Top 10 Farmer? Uh, top 10 Farmer here. We are half behind those people who like uh, animal abusing. So, but we're just chilling, also killing a little bit. Um, yeah, we have killed a few enemies, but not a lot. Like, nothing to write home about. I think you guys saw me clearing, you know, uh, some stuff, but mainly with the hero, you know. There's no reason to injure our, uh, our TTs yet. Uh, people are fighting a little bit, but um, all good. And then uh, the general stats are just, we're now on day five. Um, still more Romans signing up. Oh, Gaul is, uh, is kicking ass. Um, and yeah, hmm, Han all at 14%. Uh, but now we're at 14 in production. Uh, and five overall. Offensive strength, we have risen from 45 yesterday to now 22. Uh, Defensive-wise, we fall from 1 to 5. Um, but just natural uh, up, up and down scaling. Uh, and CP, we're just slacking hard. But uh, that's due to us pushing production right now. What do I mean animal abusing? <laughs> Sorry if that's that, uh, you know, uh, all PVE, you know player versus environment. And environment is mainly Natars and uh, animals. Oh, that was a nice farm. That has grown up nicely. Um, so, rating this for resources. That's animal abuse. Right. Yeah. Animal grinding really does a lot for uh, for the income. Who has most hero XP? Okay, there you go, dude. We're at eight and uh, f so four thousand behind. So you can also see experience-wise, like it's not the top one. They're not even here in the top ten. That's that that's kind of astonishing to me, though, that uh, the top animal abuser is not even using their hero really. Like they're mainly clearing with uh, normal units. Um. No, wait, they were on the list. <laughs> I'm blind. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, okay, okay. Now it makes more sense, but their kill rate on the animals are fairly higher. Ah, okay. 3,000 without the hero, so, okay. They're doing it right. But, uh, yeah, we just have a little bit more limitation to 
to good animal oasis. But uh, Yura has just been running around the spawn though, and have been having a blast. Uh, let's see. We're landing in seven minutes. Okay. Oh, okay. I think so. Usually, night is better for for raiding, but uh, I don't know. I'm not on line at that time. <sighs> oh, I need my beauty sleep. <coughs> and uh, Summer hasn't really said anything about it. She's just um, doing her job, I guess. But I think it's a little better. Yeah. Thanks, Nick. 40% increase in rating. That kind of makes sense. Yeah, we can just do the farm list. Boom. So, very basic right now. Like, I don't have a third village to sit and sim up right now. So, <laughs> so it's just these big chunks. But these big chunks mean so much for our production. So, right now, at this stage of the game, it's amazing getting uh, this stuff done. Uh, but it uh, there's not much to do, guys. <laughs> but it's nice hanging out with you. Um... Oh, we need a palace, right? Yeah, okay. I'll do that now, like honestly. Because it's always nice just put on two fields, sim a level level on the palace while you do these fields. Like as you saw earlier, I just also NPC one field, so it doesn't matter that I cannot auto complete the palace, I'll still just auto complete a field. Uh, how often do you send farm list? Currently, we're at anywhere between seven and ten minutes. I think I usually just go around nine because that's uh, what Summer told me. Our lists are perfect at nine minutes. The other day, and I was like, oh, well, then I just kind of incorporated that into spotting here the time difference between that and here, and when I look at the last send. So, so anyway, between seven and ten minutes, then it's all good. But uh, but we variate a lot. Also, when you do other stuff like take a shower, and um, then there's a little delay. So, all good. Uh, there are no slaves. It's just me. And then Summer, who's a night slave. Uh, and then Nick. Nick. Nick just signed up to be a slave, so. Can you show Summer's account? Yeah. This is, uh, this is Summer's account. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know, she's a duel. So. But uh, we have Paige, who is uh, a subscriber to the channel. So he uh, he got a little 9C next to us, next to our capital. We got uh, the good boys here, the randoms, who uh, started as Gaul and are doing offense. So right now they got catapults and they're trashing players around us. Um, just hitting them with like eight waves and just destroying stuff. Uh, we got uh, Dr. Midden Rasen, who's just chilling up here, doing God knows what. I have no idea. Um, and then we have Nick, who's here. He took his 50% for the spawn. Damn. And then, uh, yeah. And uh, he went far out. I have no idea where to find his capital. Like, he's in the middle of fucking nowhere. Just doing production, I guess. Um, fighting the 
Egypt guy there with 125%. But he's there and we're like here. So I, I tried to get Nick to settle here um, on this one, but now it's taken. Um, another Mim guy to kill. So I don't know. There are people settling all over the place. So maybe we place like here, I think. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Um, just as long as it's close to the capital. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna settle a hammer. There's no real good croppers left. So, yeah. Yeah, we could do a 9C over here, but kind of pointless, I would say, currently. Hmm. Yeah, Nick just wanted the the cropper in the countryside just for its production. So he's really gonna run that to like twelve or something, and then he's gonna settle a hammer over here and some more supporters, I think, and, <laughs> and try to kill that guy or something stupid. I have no idea what his plan was. I tried telling him to keep it simple, but uh, he likes elaborate things. Um, but yeah, we're just chilling there and. Uh, all right, you're getting oasis, nice. Yeah, so. <coughs> so we're just doing random stuff. It's all good, nothing new. Uh, what about Hero here, is he home? No, he's about to land, yeah. Uh, and I need to extend horse queue. So I think this hit will also just dump into the queue to get an hour or so. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No, Yurji. Um, we play X3, X5, and X10s. Um, but uh, currently, yeah, the only available server right now was an X3. So that's why we're chilling here. For now, there's an X10 in two weeks, but yeah, we don't know what we want to do. I don't like playing multiple servers, but uh, sometimes this server is a little slow. So we could also dial this one back and then go to the X10, but yeah. Right now, I just haven't played Gold in a long time, so we're testing that and having fun. Yeah, rank 1 Raider has no cropper. Yeah. They just have satellites. Maybe somebody else is building a cropper for them, or... Yeah, we'll see. We also had a guy like that on another server, and he just grinded, 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 and then he just burned out, and everybody left the account, and it was like, okay, that's it, okay, bye, I guess. And um, so, some people do that, which is also entertaining, I guess. But I think they look like they have a bigger plan, but uh, I wouldn't say what they're really up to. Yeah, stream against SWAT. Well, that's, that's a plan. Yeah, but now we're at like eight minutes, so I'm like, 
let's click it. I don't know guys, it's a little mellow again, not that much to handle, it's just about that coverage. Earlier I was just watching movies, might just do the same and then uh, kick back. Uh, it is weekend after all. I think a lot of you guys are asking for schedules and when we'll be online and stuff like that. And The problem with Travian is that anything can happen when we're offline too, So, um, but, but maybe I need to do some boundaries for myself and then take the weekends off or something um, thinking about that but uh, could also just be playing some uh, horizon <laughs> but uh, oops um, I don't know what to do because yeah there's not that much brain stuff going on right now uh, we need more units and uh, and these fields are kind of high so, eh. After all, Nick is back, so you could just take account. I started streaming because uh, I need to get some hours in here, having fun with you guys, and then, uh, yeah, he wasn't around to entertain me. So, let's see. What about the test ones here? Like, we can just take those and uh, grind them into the first list there. Boom. Closer stuff is always nice. Deactivate. What about this one? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Do you upgrade TTs and Smithy? That's a great question, actually. Uh, but no, not as far as I know. No, they're still level zero. Like, there is no need. Um. They have enough power to again single hit uh, with one TT, uh, so there's no real reason to do it uh, right now. It's just about having more TTs. And again, the Smithy is level three, but that was only to be able to build the stable. Right, so. <coughs> you could say that, Nick. I think the biggest change is the fact that there's no longer the CP difference. So you don't have to have that high level of units before they're able to micro raid. And at some point it's nice, uh, like we can just do a quick uh, calculation to be honest, because uh, there. And my plan was no, we'll, we'll just use the in-game one. Um, let's say we have one TT, but there's a wall or something here. I wonder if at level 20, can it break? No. <laughs> no. No, it's not supposed to be able to either, uh, but Can we, well, I'm not sure when it'll trigger, but at some point it makes sense to have a high level so you don't have to remove walls to make life easier for yourself. But yeah, okay, 25 here. Um, 
then you can breach the wall. So, 25 at level 20. And you don't lose TT. Like, it could make sense in those instances, but yeah. but well, better just to cut other stuff down. <sighs> Oh, we have more people joining the Discord. Nice. Pretty chill. So yeah, that's how it goes, Christian. Like, uh, I told you, man. Going all in. <laughs> You guys want to see something sad? Ouch. That's a lot of dead snipe catapults. That shit gotta hurt. <laughs> uh, God damn it, Wolf. Love it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Poor stun guys. We're probably going to get ghosted too. And, uh, you know, stuff happens. Hmm. Can we do. I couldn't be seen, and then we just got another palace level. Like, no, I don't even have to. So, organic. Oh, yeah. Like, our rating is pretty good. Uh, like, I'm not saying they get full stacks, but, like, we, we keep getting resources in. And our production is uh, is pretty heavy right now. So combined it uh, it stacks nicely uh, we also got a big load there for the hero boom boom and then we talked about putting up a big queue I think I want to do that and then we can just wait and then we get enough resources next time we hit with a hero there's some nice oasis like right next to us uh, this one was huge yeah so so we can quickly get some resources now uh, organically and put on level 8 there or 9 and then NPC into another 9 and then complete Four minutes. So I'll be back in four minutes, guys. You know what's up.
Yo, yo, yo. Alright. I don't need to send farmless just yet. Nothing fancy. Yeah, 20 seconds on that hero. Oh yeah, we're not even doing any ra uh, trading, Nick. Hot damn. And did they change how that works? Yeah, they did. Huh. And I can accept it if I want. And it still has that uh, old coloring system. Hmm. Okay. But I presume it doesn't remember the numbers anymore. Hmm. I'm not going to do the trade right now, because we need everything. And we might risk overflowing. <laughs> ah, ah, we have some decent capacity. Um, yeah, let's just set the raid list. Okay, well, we can do that. Uh, that's fine with me, Nick. So, as Nick suggests, like, we can push the stable up to 20, and then we can also push the granary to 20, slow and steady. So we really get some capacity, because we want to put up some nice big offers, like, usually you do, like this. Um, like, just get the double, and then local leaders can trade their, tra their crop into... And usually I set a maximum of like two hours, and then we can create an offer like that. And then we make... Wait, what? No, fuck. Ah, that's gonna be so annoying. Like, then I have to do this every single time I want to create an offer? And I can't say duplicate offer? I can't... I can't do anything. If you click twice fast, it makes two offers. <laughs> no, that yeah, yeah, I, I get, I get your point, but god damn it, that's so stupid. So yeah, a glitch can like because previously, you know, you can just. Okay, this is the offer type I want, and then I spent down on all the wood, all the clay, all the iron, and then I just wait for the crop to bank up, and then we can NPC, build some stuff, and then trade the rest again. But now I have to individually create every single fucking offer, and it, and it doesn't even remember the settings of the resources. Yeah, 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 well, they did the same, yeah, yeah, when they created, they recreated the whole marketplace, yeah, they just kind of ruined all the cached information that you could apply by backspacing and stuff like that, you know, so, but this is just, no, I'm not fast enough <laughs> for double clicking. Okay, so I guess we're not trading, Nick, anymore, like, that's just stupid, then we'll have to do bigger backs or something. Like, yeah, yeah. They they really messed up some things with the with the marketplace update, and uh, and they never fixed everything. Oh, it's so stupid, guys. It's a little sad. Oh, did we hit with the hero? Yeah, I think so. Luckily, I didn't kill him. I'm just about to fill him with full life again because this is gonna be a while even though we're completing tens and nines but it'll be a little bit later 
so I think right now the best benefit is to keep the hero grinding and then use some uh, some ointments ointments I see a big one over here, but yeah, I think I already hit it. Oh, that's a big one, but uh, we're probably hurt. Like this one, we could also hit again. It should give some uh, nice resources. Yeah, could be bigger. Well, congrats on the Oasis, my man. Oh, I think I'm gonna burn ointments. Simply just to do some more big hits, like this one. We can hit, hit that twice, that's in a decent distance. Twenty seconds, but he should easily be able to hit this one no problem. Like it's just close by. Easy five thousand resources, and uh, he only loses five life. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'll burn. I'll burn all the ointments, guys. We're just going to grind everything that's close. New plan. New plan for the evening. <laughs> Let's finish uh, these all to 10 as fast as we can. <coughs> Do the Mad King. Burn. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> burn them all. And then you're going to come visit me at my apartment and you're going to stab me in the back. Just buy more ointments. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Need money. Palace there. We can do a level 10 soon. So we'll bang up a little bit more than that. So we also, when we NPC, we can actually put on the next level of palace. So we're not that much in a hurry. Uh, well, guys, we can organically build a nine now. And then we can NPC into another one and boom. Da 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 da. Oh yeah, chilling and food. Oh, oh! Stump got a building plan this round for the Vivi. Just give a little clap for that. Black Adam, that was, I don't know, yeah, could have been better that movie, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, two minutes for a hit, <coughs> doesn't matter that much, let's see, um, Oh, we need to grind. I have grinded a lot of the stuff. We could also hit that one. Just to get some quick resources. Same as that one. We can grind a lot on these if we want. Um, this one's good. Uh, this one also. Could do one hit. 
But they're not that close, actually. Yeah. Grinding this twice, I think we should just do for now. And then we'll figure out what to hit. We could also maybe do long distance hitting. I don't know. No, it doesn't look like it. No. Yeah, also interesting. But but again, oh well, this one. But then we need to use b books, and we don't really have that many books. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think there's any... Th like, we can also use a bucket, kill the hero, rotate to cab area, but it's not like... Uh, these have started respawning though. Maybe there will be something to raid here later on. But right now it's like they're nicely close, but it'll take us like a second and then we're an hour and then everything's clean and then there's no reason to be there. But there might be some uh, longer stuff away that could be interesting, at least that one. Maybe here, down here too, yeah. Here too, this one too, that's massive. So maybe, <laughs> but it's also far. Two fifty, two fifty, not all bad. Thanks, Gryffindor. I'll look into it with the emotes and uh, and stuff. Mm, a little early for that NPC, I would say. I'm just gonna wait a little bit. Here is home in 30. Alrighty. Oh, now Gryffindor sent something to me in private. But yeah, we have a suggestion box in the Discord, so just join that and uh, <laughs> and you can place it there. But uh, but uh, all feedback is appreciated, however way it's given. Uh, let's break that one. Boom. So Hero will be home in 20 minutes. Decent distance. And we can hit that two times and it'll still give like, yeah, 
12,000 every time. Uh, 14,000. And then we're down to 58 health. And we can just uh, simulate again. And then we get 8, 9,000 on it next time. So, and then heroes down to 42% health, and then we can grind something else. Boom, boom. Uh, 3,000 left over. What's the price on it? Yeah, we would have to wait a little bit longer. But we have the granary capacity for it, so. Slow and steady, guys. Slow and steady. Thanks for joining the Discord, Okra. Do, 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 do. Oh, everybody around you is active. Well, just sim. Just chillax. Stop the raiding. Just sim and uh, take it slow. Use that channel for ideas on how to grow and improve the streams. Well, yeah, yeah, but uh, it's in there. Ah! <laughs> oh, Christian, you are Gryffindor. Ah! Funky. Okay, now I gotcha. <laughs> Uh, everybody has like different names on different platforms like trust me I'm very bad with names so these conditions to work under with all these random aliases like it's killing me <laughs> it's also every time I can say Nick's name I'm like that's Nick that's Nick but no here on Discord or here on Twitch he's Vikrof like I don't want to confuse people too much you know All right, cool, 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 cool. So I'm kind of pronouncing it correctly. I was like, is it Cristiano or Christian or whatever? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, that's why I can't become a teacher, Nick. I can't become a teacher because I, I I can't remember people's name. Like I'm very good with faces, but uh, so I can always be like, oh, I know that that dude, like. <laughs> Dude, get over here. Boom. Let's get some raiding done. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
save. Okay. All right, guys. Now we are stalking a page. So he told us he was about to finish the tents. Oh, he's grinding hard here. Getting that production up, and he's also working on yeah, yeah. Pretty good, pretty good production. And the capital is coming up beautifully. Cool. And again, that's what you can do in BP. Nice and chill. So that's the first time I logged into another account this round. <laughs> chill yeah I don't have alerts like I had on the twitch stream um, like with twitch own tool but that was some crazy stuff and the sounds were insane um, so I actually like it now where I just notice people following and stuff like later on uh, but I'll look into that Christian um yeah. could look into it tomorrow then I'll take the day off <laughs> um I've never trade played Travian on iPad like we do it on I of course on the phone uh, I think that's pretty good I know some people who play on iPad which is also okay. Um, I think some people enjoy that. But again, nothing really beats a PC, to be honest. Um, but I think it's okay to play from iPad. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, Christian. but yeah here was going through the big hit hmm. <coughs> hmm. we need to figure out if we're gonna build that hammer or what we're gonna settle because I think the the easiest thing is just to settle a hammer or a hammer town we're not necessarily gonna start building a hammer in it but we can build it just to get the nice infrastructure more granary capacity and uh, and overall start some maybe some TT rating instead of rating here from the capital like these TTs can also be used for raid scouting and other stuff so but mm, can also find a spot 250% I don't know who's that guy this guy settled here and we would interrupt him in his 50s. Mm. Uh, okay, this one is still open. So we could do a 15C real quick. It's some nice production. Hey, Suicide. Welcome back. It's going slow and steady. Like, rank 14 in production or something like that. Uh, So, so climbing and raiding, all good. <laughs> All right, Bamba. 
All right. But now, Nick, it's, I'm not freaking out. I was just sitting here thinking to myself, maybe I should take the day off tomorrow. I could look into some of those links provided by Christian and uh, I could take a break day and, uh, and I could come back streaming from Monday and th through the week. Um, so that was more like, so what are we going to be doing tomorrow while I'm off stream? Uh, we could kind of explain that. But... Um, Okay, yeah. <coughs> it's just, um, like, but there's not much more to it. Like, we're going to finish production here in spawn, right? Stable 20. And then we're going to be focusing on 11, hero mansion 15, go to 12, then go to 13, then take the third hero mansion. And by that time, we're also have, going to have one or two new towns. Like uh, right now, we are running two small towns in each of them. And then here, I guess we'll reset them. That'll give 500. Yeah, I think we generate enough CP plus that. Two small parties more. And then we can uh, settle. And then we can do big parties afterwards. Uh, and, and, uh, like, get those town halls up because our production is completed, more or less. And then we can focus on that third. It might be this over here, just to get a 15C. Like, they're just cheaper to build and they give more in income. Uh, a little cheat trick with the gold, but, um, so we could do that. And then we can settle a hammer next or something like that. Uh. <coughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, the settlement will be off too. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean, Bamba. You can make your Discord a Travian Alliance community in the future using bots, etc. Yeah, I guess. There's some. I like. I already have a bot. Like uh, I have the U Uber bot. So some things I have automated, but no nothing really runs automated in there. Anyways. Um. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I can always go back to it on Monday, what we're going to do. But I think some people are also following and seeing what should we be doing next um, on the server. Um, so just trying to give an indication to people. Uh, it's about growth, economic growth. Like we're going to keep running production in the spawn with units, but otherwise I think we're going to be slacking a little bit. Like, we still got a few days, like, the only thing we're really concerned about is maybe, like, this guy next to us. Um, he's in BP, but he'll be in beginner's protection for the next three days. Um, so, we don't really need that much defense placed or built um, until in two days or one and a half day. So, we have a lot of time now. We can just invest into production. Um just only do 30 minutes tonight in the evening and update around progress for the account. Yeah, I could do that too, but I don't feel think it's that fun for people just to get a 30 minute update. It's more fun when we do stuff together. Um, but but I feel yeah, I, I could do a brief update tomorrow evening. But um, yeah, yeah, we'll figure it out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I thought you meant tomorrow by tonight. Um, I get you. I feel you. Uh, yeah. Sending full lists. Uh, still just feels. Uh, you're on the way back, so, oh yeah. Gotta be a kid, right? There we go. 
two more level nines and it's gonna get us from 3500 to 4200 so they give like 350 a piece um, pretty good trade in production there uh, then we need the last one to nine here then we're gonna get that big uh, reward for even no complete economy this one 276 holy shit uh, we're missing 600 but we're also very close to population I will automatically drop yeah before the level 10s are done hmm. Hmm, six minutes then we can send the hero down here so again this is just what we're doing all the time guys just finding more income building things yeah also soon close here 20 pop away or CP away yeah. capital is not gonna give that much but again one two three four five more and uh, and all the 10 reward will also drop that's massive. This one, five thousand <laughs> three hundred and thirty-one XP. So the next, this level and next level is gonna be pretty easy. Nice, nice. talking about my account or yours <laughs> mine <laughs> um, okay um, but yeah that's the plan finishing level 10s but you wanted me to sim palace at the same time so but I'm still... Yeah, okay, I see what you mean. Like you want to use the hero inventory resources to finish cap. We could do that, but I want to finish 9 here. Uh, yeah, this is still a bit away from getting triggered. So 276 plus the other one, that's going to reset us and we're going to be hitting a big oasis again here with the hero. He'll be home in three minutes. Yeah. So, yeah. And then we reinvest the rest rewards from cap to spawn after. Yeah, we can do that. Sure. I'm down. I'm down for that. Okay, that close by. Done. Yeah, sounds good. 
Sounds good, Nick. But spawn is not just done with production, like we're also gonna push stable to 20 and that's not necessarily that cheap, Nick, so that might push your deadline a little bit. Um, stable needs to go to 20, that's 240k resources. That's, uh, that's still uh, a few hours. Okay. Okay, fair enough. Then it'll work out. Come on. Get back here. Damn hero. a new bakery to five at some point. Hmm. But maybe just, I don't know, to hold to 11 and then we can do <laughs> bakery levels. There we go, now we can get another 800k, oh, 8,000 over here. Yeah. yeah, for me I just mix it in at some point. Um. But yeah, slow and steady guys, raiding, hero raiding, simming, completing the important stuff, gonna get this up to to 10 now, because Nyx wants it. Uh, there's not that much stuff close to spawn. Yeah, starting to look interesting there. Sounds uh, sounds wonderful, Christian. <laughs> Cheers, my man. Ah, that's the good stuff.
This one's right next to our capital. This guy did that. Uh, it was high pop, and uh, we can raid him with 5 TT. That's nice. We'll just move him to. Oh, yeah, I moved around on stuff. Big list there. And this is getting tested. Oh, it's just to add a few more farms for uh, the increase in TTs. Hey, Jalen. Welcome back, my man. Yeah, sounds like a fine plan, Nick. Getting that TS level up. Like, it's still pretty cheap having them here uh, from 4 to 8. Really gets extra pricey at, uh, at the extra higher levels. So, hey, Fumus. And Kobe. P oh, did people just coming in? <laughs> Can't stop. Can't stop the rock, you can't stop the rock, can't stop the rock, you can't. Oh. Oh, it's best for your co workers, 23, 24. I'm not sure. We have this amazing website in Denmark where it, which is called Which Week Is It? <laughs> <laughs> it's week 16 okay so there's like damn seven weeks until you can have your vacation that's in two months I'll be yeah pretty much around the time uh, the summer holidays is gonna start like oh well there there goes those plants <laughs> out the window why is this one? Oh yeah, of course it was still in PP. So it doesn't trigger. Here we got 90. Oh, we can wait a few minutes. Heroes on the way to Raid Oasis, five minutes. Do 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 do. <sighs> yeah, pretty much suicide. It's it it's like it's like new clean towns. Or like yeah, you find a big guy with five towns and you wanna uh, remove all his units and then start farming it. And you can put it on the, like the big list with a hundred TTs or two hundred or how, however much in the beginning, and then you can sort them out or you know uh, organize them afterwards and remove you know stuff. But it's just to have a big list of big stuff because all the other stuff is one or two horses, um, and then the big lists are higher population, so they require a little bit higher. But this is still low numbers. But so these could go directly into the micro list, but we're still so early on in the server that uh, that it makes sense uh, having them on that big list right now. <coughs> it's also a a list that you are more inclined to go check. Let's put it like that. Otherwise, at some point, we're just gonna run 99 reports there and then classify this one as our primary reports page. So whenever we check in here, we get these uh, highlighted if we hit L any yellow or red swords, but all the green ones we, we won't care about. But right now, I just want to, you know, filter all, check what comes in and out. I could resend on these, 
bad boys that are getting full bags, but it's fine. We're just running with this intensity um, on the rating. <coughs> And yes, it would also send on those the most frequently. Like, it would always take these first eight. That's, I don't know, overall that takes 36 TTs. And then, you know, whatever is left would go to these other lists. This one first, and then... So, when it auto-sends, it also sends on everything in the closest distance. And that's why we organize them from certain... Uh, travel distances. So everything close, everything close, uh, and then sometimes it sends everything if we've been away too long, you know, and you need to actually send the full list. Oh, you order by bounty size? Well, you can also, yeah, do that. Like there is different settings within uh, here, uh, where you set it there, and then, and then you need to. So everything with full bounty would get prioritized, I guess. Right now we're just yeah, running on distance. Sorry. <coughs> How much we're rating per hour now? Do you know, Nick? I think around 50,000. Probably 60. Uh, when we really hit some good bounties with the hero. But again, when the hero does 33% of our rating, then his travel time to hits and so forth really kind of fluctuates our rating a little bit. But I think 40, 50k we get from our ordinary uh, TT rating. Thanks, guys. Thanks. <laughs> Quite a bunch of them, yeah, small ones as well. Yeah, sure, cool. I no, dude, man, it's fine. Like, I, sometimes I also just go on the map and add a hundred farms, and I can't use them for shit, so I just move them to a list further away, or, or like an in inactive list. But then I suddenly have a, you know, a, a list consisting of. 100 farms within 50 to 100 fields away or from 100 to 150 you know so but again playing the horse based races in Travian kind of helps you with hitting your limit on the micro rating simply because they get home so fast so yeah rating with one t, t on things instead of two clubs uh, then t the club travel time and and that's where it comes in where the whole rating limit in training and kinda is pretty fucked really fucked because you cannot micro rate enough with those uh, clubs that you have I, I really don't like that aspect that really nerves Tutan a lot but again that's, that's at a high level uh, so was my two cents on that one. Um, uh, when we have to send hero at 20 minutes, then it's around. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, TKs are so slow. They, they could easily buff the TKs to give them more travel speed. Easily. <coughs> I don't think anybody would complain. Thirty-eight four minutes ago, here I was home and yeah. So we just hit right. <sighs> oh, Nick wanted me to focus on the capital. <laughs> Let's see. 
Maybe do some Q here. Yeah. Forty minutes. Is there any website that finds fifteen croppers? I don't think so, man. Um I don't know any tools per se. Like I searched the other day and I think I saw some links to like a browser uh like just a website that maybe could I don't know. Is there a restriction how many outgoing attacks you can have? Y yes there is Fumos. They re implemented it. So there's a uh, 20k outgoing and incoming limit based on your entire account. So uh, unfortunately they re-implemented it for the sake of better server performance. So it's a uh, it's account wide. Well, yeah, they removed it, like, new feature, and, like, everybody was like, yeah, hell yeah, and uh, I also did an interview on a server with one guy where where they like, like, if he's a very hard, hardcore raider, so he found, found it fucking amazing, and then mid through the server, Travian went in, like, ah, it's too many uh, server issues, uh, fuck these top raiders, like, we're just gonna implement it on all servers starting here on Monday or something, and then, like, Everybody went fucking ham because, you know, people were halfway through a server. People knew that, you know, they went into this server with the expectations of going f super crazy with their micro rating and then suddenly get a, get told, like, no, you can't do this. So people went, uh, started rioting and throwing stuff. And uh, was it that server where... Mustafa visited their a headquarters too, or <laughs> I can't remember, but but yeah, so they reinstated, and instead of having the limit at 10 incoming and outgoing, it, would it was raised to 20k in and outgoing, um, which is kind of an okay compromise, however, it kind of still just really hurts Tutan. because if you want to raid with all your hammers as Tutan, and like, no, no way. No way you can stay within those boundaries, especially if you're playing on, uh, you know, in the boonies, like super far out. Like you will just have way too many units traveling all the time. Even you, not even boots can help you. Uh, there was performance issues then. Um, it it was mainly something that, but but it had nothing really to do with the reports and stuff like that. It was when when the top accounts were doing scoutings and then checking their reports that forced some lags on the server. And I don't know why it should, but that was the only time I really got some input from players that had that issue, which sounds super weird. Uh, and it's not because they changed the amount of. I don't know if it the reports triggered with the amount of reports coming in from all their rating or whatever, but it didn't necessarily... That was the thing, like, it didn't apply any effect to the people there. Maybe it did to the core system and then to the top rating players that hit the max. But all, like me, who was just chilling around, not really rating, I like, I had no performance issues. So I was like, why do you go in and apply these rules when when the people pushing the system to the max, they get issues with performance. For me, that's like, that's a fair trade for going all out on the production and rating. So while I'm not affected by it as a guy not rating, so I'm like, again, you, you want your system to run perfectly, no matter if it's top radar or whatever, but, it was like a rule change that wasn't really that necessary. Uh, it was also more affecting the later stages of the game, but yeah, I just like giving people the option to go all out and do their best performance because micro raiders and high level activity players were actually able to raid as much as people who were teching. 
And that is kind of what you want, right? You want to be able to even it out and make it more viable for, for players to counteract uh, techers or at least perform at the same level and has as equal large hammers. So... Yeah, that's actually true, Nick. Uh, maybe it was a Minton problem because Minton has that plugin where he just auto selects, like he can select like this, and then pfft, it just opens all individual reports in the br in his browser on different tabs, right? So doing that to the server that might cause these performance issues, right? But again, that has nothing to do with the actual rating. So. And yeah, it would have been better if they put a limit on the actual towns. So you get both incentive to raid from multiple town ta towns, and at the same time you wouldn't hit the limit. But again, I don't know if there was a problem to begin with or not. Like, it was like, I, I have, we have experienced crazier servers with more issues. That is fucking for sure. So I can't pinpoint and say it's because of a raid limit. I uh, I don't work for TGE, so I don't have access to to their server info. So <coughs> ah, that's why he did it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so again, but that has nothing to do with the rating. So I'm like, there wasn't that many issues with it. So I don't personally like the rate limitation. Uh, people should be able to go all out. But, you know, you win some, you lose some. Like the offer creation functionality. Like, <laughs> makes no sense. Let's recreate a feature from ground up and then forget everything. Boom, boom, boom. Here we're still on the way home. Hmm. Well, the VV faking limitation was needed after all, you know, since people could break the game. Oh, there we got a hero. So, hmm. What should we bash him into? Hmm. That one is starting to have banged up a fair amount, and he's super close, so. Hmm. Oh, we also got a pennant. Uh, wasn't on adventure, so. I don't know, Fumos. Like, you did, they shouldn't be related, and I'm not sure if it's still an issue when he does it, but I don't think so. But again they might overlap somehow in the back end of their system, but I yeah, can't really say. But that's also why we're like, why not improve TKs on Teutons so they actually have some harder infantry or faster infantry. So that would even things out a little bit uh, for me. Forty—that's five minutes. Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. I think they should have more off power on the paladins. <laughs> yeah, could be. Uh, 
I would just prefer better TKs. Otherwise, you're just creating another Hun race. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> 165. Yeah, let's let's just make the Paladins better than the TKs. Yeah, that that, that that'll fix everything. <laughs> while they still have their defensive power right uh, hero oh yeah on the way to raiding yeah all right so i actually have a little break time here i can i think we're at like six seven minutes here yeah six and a half seven so let's just Boom, said that. I'm just gonna go pee, guys, and uh.
up guys what happened to Dr. Mitten Rasen I don't know I don't know I think they're still chilling around but uh, but yeah they kind of stopped working on their capital I think um, wait wait no 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 he's still here right but pretty low pop there on the spawn and uh Capital two, I don't know. Oh, he also left the alliance, or what? Uh, oh yeah, <laughs> he left it eight minutes ago. <laughs> well, I think we lost a the viewer there, guys. God damn. <laughs> so uh, I don't know. I don't know what he's up to. But, uh, but yeah, that's how it goes. I don't expect much from you guys, so don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, let's see. Maybe we should just hit that one real quick. Yes, you can only exceed my expectations page. That is for sure. Like, I still play this game as uh, me against the world, I think. Um, maybe he's going to wait for the 10x. Who knows? But, uh, you know, you get inspired and then you get tired and uh, realize, oh, why was I playing this game? It takes too much of my time and then... You know, you don't come and say goodbye, you just leave the game and <laughs> never look back. Uh, that's also how it goes sometimes. Mm, yeah, yeah, we can send it. That's fine. Kiril doesn't have info for 10x? Yeah, Kiril has here, but I'm not sure if it has uh, fighting. Yeah, it does. I don't know. I think it has some limitations to 10x, but I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah. But um, or maybe that's ah, it's maybe Getter. Oh yeah, I <laughs> I think I hate Getter for issues with X10 because it can take the the guy who made TG uh, like a long time before he applies an X10 server, and you know two weeks into a X10 server, then the server is almost over. So sometimes you don't have getter tools available on a, on a 10x server, which is kind of sad. <laughs> but um, <clears throat> that's how it goes. We should dump that into the capital here at spawn. We should, like, yeah, I should just do queues. No, wait, we're missing that to nine. I'm gonna finish that because that'll give us a big chunk. Yeah, boom. And then we can just invest everything into the capital. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we should just. Mm. Mm. 17,000 left over. We can't even put two on. So, the question is if we should just sim that palace. I think I'll do that. And then we can make the last level 10 here and just auto complete that. Yeah. And then we're just missing the last three. Farm tool. Okay. Yeah. Maybe Trefco is better for an active finder there. Ah, 
But yeah, guys. Um, I think I'll take a break tomorrow, then I can go for a walk. I can work a little bit on the stream about all the technical aspects. Um, so I would be back Monday afternoon, I think. Um, Mid-afternoon, maybe. 15 o'clock. Uh, and then we can do an evening stream there and uh, do that for the rest of the week. Um, I'll try also to set up like a time frame from where I and when I will be online so you guys can stay updated. That has been requested since forever. Uh, but now when it's more dedicated I could probably set up a better timetable. But the problem is you can't really set in single days. You have to say like every Monday it's from this hour or every Tuesday from this hour. So. I like keeping it loosey-goosey, but I can't really be allowed to do that, I guess. Um, but uh, I'll put something up there. Um, again, just working on feels, uh, getting that up, getting that stable to 20 afterwards, and then work on the capital. Uh, so the account will look a lot different. Um, and again, settlement is what the fuck yeah so there's no uh, 15 C's left anymore so I think we'll just settle a hammer which is a hammer slash granary town slash just a new supporter um, and then uh, it won't get three chiefs but it will just be the main raid hammer uh, so at least they'll have a tons of catapults. It's also good to get that down so you can get that siege going and stuff like that uh, in the long run. At least if you want to make a VV hammer. But but yeah. I'll talk things out with Nick. Maybe we can also just settle it there and then take a 50% for it. I would love to spend cages on this, I think. Um, <coughs> um, get some more cages too but uh, yeah maybe just uh, for me uh, enjoy the weekend a little bit relax kick, kick back and uh, and find some other streamer for myself as well <laughs> uh, yeah yeah um, yeah you know the drill guys it's just hero raiding raiding and then uh, doing some simming and oh heroes home Let's see. Ah. How much health left? It'll reset soon. 38. Life. Uh. That one looks interesting. Ah, he still dies, but 38. What about on fifty? Yeah, then he has ten life, so we can give him twelve, and then we're super safe. Oh, where was it? Was it that one? Yeah. So, yeah, 12 to be on the safe side, but then he had 10 in advance, so maybe we should just give him 8 life. That'll do. So... But yeah, you gotta be smart about it sometimes so we can complete that, get that extra resources and work that into the spawn. Um, and then yeah, keep grinding and grinding and grinding. So, um, yeah. Well, let's look at the stats just before we wind down here. 
42 in pop rank now. Now we're 9 in production, guys. So we climbed actual 5 levels and we still haven't converted the hero into production. So we might be top 3 right now, maybe, almost. Uh, we're 4 overall in production. We also climbed one level there. Um, defensive 5, offensive 22. I don't expect us to be climbing that much here until we get the staple up and even then uh, I don't expect us necessarily to have that high offensive power uh, per day and so forth with the CP but uh, we'll get back in the game here in a day or two again uh, we're gonna reset the parties here in three hours and then uh, big parties tomorrow or maybe two more small parties. We'll see how is it's needed uh, for our development here. Um, but yeah, we'll wing those next couple of days. We're gonna get a new supporter and uh, cap fields will be up pretty high come Monday when I'll see you guys again. It's amazing that you follow, subscribe and uh, do all these things to make the environment uh, very nice and chill here. So thanks for looking in, guys. Uh, I hope you'll have a great weekend, and uh, I'll see you Monday. Bye.